It's said that soldiers marching in unison across a bridge can cause it to collapse. This scenario often appears in movies. A military unit steps onto a bridge, and suddenly the entire structure gives way. Is this actually related to the synchronized steps of the troops? The Mythbusters decided to build a bridge and have a mini army march across it to see if their rhythm could cause the bridge to vibrate. If so, the miniature soldiers should bounce like they're on trampoline. Adam began building the bridge. The suspension bridge was 60 feet long and 6 feet high, made from 6 long and flat reinforced box structures forming the deck. Following the model, Adam completed the bridge. Meanwhile, Jamie received a set of Condec actuators sent by fans. These devices are typically used for industrial valve control, but today, they would serve as the core of a miniature marching army. Twelve helmeted soldier models wearing combat boots. Now it was time to see whether Jamie's mini army could shake the bridge apart. Everything was ready. Jamie activated the miniature troops. Their footsteps were powerful, but since they couldn't synchronize their steps, they ended up damaging Adam's bridge through brute force. The Mythbusters decided to retry the experiment. Adam repaired the bridge, and Jamie restarted the mini army. But again, the steps didn't match the bridge's natural frequency. The vibration waves didn't fully spread across the entire structure. In the end, the bridge collapsed, but it was due to raw force, not resonant frequency. Jamie decided to rebuild the setup. He replaced the mini soldiers with a large vibration machine. Would it be able to shake the bridge to failure this time? Once activated, the vibrations aligned with the bridge's frequency, but still weren't enough to break it. The Mythbusters increased the machine's weight and tried again. This time, the bridge did collapse, but it still wasn't the result of resonance. Finally, Adam couldn't resist and manually destroyed the bridge himself. In conclusion, the Mythbusters couldn't recreate the myth, unless the total weight of the troops is already close to the bridge's limit. Marching alone is unlikely to cause structural failure, 